Hey, you want to take a little break from talking about Donald Trump yeah. for just a minute? You want a little palate cleanser? Let's do it. Okay. You guys ever play this game called uh, Quick Draw on Google? Mm -hmm. You play at this? You know what this is? You go on Google, and the, the little computer bot on Google, the Google bot right. says, hey, or, try to draw a bench. And yeah, then you go right. to draw the bench, and it guesses things. I see a sandwich. Yeah. Uh, I see a book. But if you get close enough to drawing the bench, it goes, I know, a bench. And then you get a point. And we're eventually teaching the computer how to take over the world, I think. I'm not sure. We're yeah, definitely teaching right. it something. I'm not sure yeah, what. Either, or that. take over art school. I'm not right. sure what it's going to take over. Anyway, it's super fun. Check it out. I'm not being paid for this plug. Right. But uh, the reason I bring it up is that a local Seattle morning show was demonstrating the game on Friday, and uh, two of the anchors were there, mm -hmm. and uh, they got the suggestion of Canon. <laughs> and, and, it, and it went a little awry. A cannon! A cannon! Oh, what do you do? What do you do? Oh, no. There's no erasing is the thing. Okay. If that's supposed to be a cannon, I guess my question is, why did someone draw all those cannons in the bathroom stall of my high school? That's a, that's a perfectly understandable right. little uh, doodle oops, okay? So nobody should feel bad about that. I want to I help out, okay? I have a lot of experience. I have a lot of experience drawing things on the air. Let me show you how to draw a cannon and not get in trouble. I can, I can imagine it's reasonable to think CBS isn't going to blur any of this, right? It's going to be fine. I'm sure it's going to be fine, OK? Yeah. So let's say the computer uh, gives you the suggestion of cannon. I'm going to write cannon uh -huh. down here at the bottom so we know that that's what I'm drawing, OK? <laughs> and nothing else, OK? Here's, here's one wheel of the cannon. Here's the other wheel of the cannon. <laughs> and we'll give it some spokes just to make sure everybody knows spokes. And then you obviously you gotta do the you gotta do the barrel. You gotta do the barrel. You gotta do the bar barrel of the cannon. Oh, like that. Okay. So far we've still got a cannon, okay. And obviously, uh, and and we gotta put the cannonball right there on <laughs> it's coming out, the cannonball's coming out, it's coming out in that direction, so we gotta put the, it's just about to leave. Just about, about to leave, okay. Then obviously down here uh, you need uh, you need a fuse. You need a fuse down here at the bottom. All right. So there it is. That's how you draw a cannon. Do we have any idea? Do we have any idea if CBS is going to let me draw a cannon? There's a slight chance that they won't let me draw the cannon. I'm being told. Well, I'll tell you what. Then tune in next time and I'll show you how to draw my penis. <laughs> But this definitely isn't. We'll be right back with Michael Weatherly.